and the Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, Disaster Management and Social Development, Sadia Omar Farouk, has maintained that an end knowledge program uh, was deliberately introduced and solely funded by the federal government to address the social gaps, especially amongst the youth, the poor and the vulnerable nationwide. The Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, Sadia Omar Farouk, disclosed this in Abuja at the closing ceremony of and knowledge expansion training program across the six geopolitical zones in Nigeria. Malikiduru has more. The minister noted that the end knowledge training component is targeted at developing competencies of the youth in software development. Adware training and creative industry, which is catalytic as well as the groundwork to make Nigeria compete in the outsourcing markets for software development. We're targeted at developing competencies of the youth in software development, hardware handling and application of ICT in the creative industry, all of which catalyzed to mainstreaming the Nigerian youth to at least take advantage of the outsourcing market for software development. We have evidences on what many of you have produced even in these training camps, uh, such as cartoon uh, applications, education applications. Speaking further, the minister noted that the ministry is committed to ensure that the strategic objective which bears the commitment of the President Mohamed Buhari's led administration to lift 100 million Nigerians out of poverty by the year 2030 achieved and sustained. Of poverty reduction and job creation innovatively, most especially as it targets the unemployed youth. Uh, for competence building and gainful employment. This is a very successful program and it's a program that has touched many lives. As I mentioned, our youth uh, have been supported uh, to be able to uh, uh, fend for themselves through these programs. They are now economically independent they can take care of themselves and their families. Speaking earlier, the Permanent Secretary Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs, who was represented by Dr. Omar Buba Bindo, has this to say. Three levels of hardware management, software evolution, and then creativity. Many of you are now literally semi-experts, but by the time you do your attachment, you will become experts, you will employ yourselves, you will employ two or three other people, and by that, you would have answered the call of Mr. President of lifting Nigerian youth out of poverty. We need entrepreneurs. We need entrepreneurs. We need young people who are creative. We need young people who are serving with ICT. And this is one pool. And similar pools are happening all over Nigeria. It is a known fact that NPower program is a critical part of the national social investment programs domiciled in the Federal Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs, Disaster Management and Social Development.